Hi guys, Lorna, welcome back to my channel. It's the middle of the day and it's all dark. It's freaking me out. Guys, I'm telling you, this is the end of the world soon. You better be careful for the environment. Please stop eating meat. Anyway, so let's start. This is not a vegan pair of shoe, not at all. So this is my new pair of shoes. I've started to work again. Oh, little bit of water. I started to work again in Dr. Martin's. If you don't follow my journey in Dr. Martin's, that's okay. It has been a bit complicated. I am in really good terms with them and I have nothing bad to say. I think they have been the first workplace that I think mental health is taking into account. So this is something I needed to say. But I do think that for today, I'm pretty happy. I've been working with Dr. Martin since 2015 and, and it's 2021. So if it has been really bad, I won't be working with them again. So that being said, let me show you the new pair, my new pair of shoes, which is the Francis sandal. Yes, Dr. Martins do make sandal and I know that the elitists do, do not like sandals. I think they do like it a bit more than they, um, they were. Um, I think three years ago, um, the really purest elitists from Dr. Martins really didn't like the sandals and they really think that this was some kind of marketing um, alternative option of shoes and they are a bit right, yes, because this is also a brand we do shoes to sell them and because it's hot out there people buy less closed shoes so we need also to do open shoes and why not doing open shoes which are kind of rock and roll right so those shoes are the francis sandals so i had the voss sandal that i'm not going to show you because they are a mess but this <laughs> but the I had quite the same sole on the Voss sandals. Um, it was the first edition of Voss. Um, the, I really think that the sole here is thicker and it's really less, um, how can I say, can really less be scratched, I think, easily. I haven't worn them again. I try to wore them one day and do a little clip and insert it in this video so I can properly say if they're good or not to walk with them. I just tried them on and so I do think that if you have the Voss sandal this sole is more um is stronger. I don't know how to say it won't you know be squished out um easily and the inside is quite the same. The inside is quite the same that the Voss, because you can see that you have this arched um, in the middle. You have this also, which is good for um, the back of your feet. And you still have this that is going a bit up. So I think if I, I'm correct, this are a bit more for, um, or flat feet you know so they can be arched a bit but mine are already arched so i know i should one day um take the other one because this is giving me a bit like i don't know how to say but this is only me all right so you don't have to follow my stupid ideas because i wanted to wear them and i will but i know that my foot aren't really the one that are matching those ones because I have often some cramps you know um, on the the tip of my toes and because this is going a bit up like this 
uh, with the voice it does make me a bit like you no know, bit um my toes a bit too straight i don't know how to say um and hurting a bit uh, the end of the toes so i hope this time i won't do this i will tell you if it does um i've seen some customer wore them and they look really comfortable with them i really do think that this is better than the Voss um, sole even if it's i think a bit higher i i don't remember i think this is four centimeters something like that um this is really comfortable too when i tried it at least um not like hurting this my little toe was okay this is really really a good you know had a good grip um not to you know your foot going everywhere in the sand all this can happen a lot so this is okay i really do like the little sort of eyelet here and what can i say this is the zebraless sole um so it should be good for grip i know that i used the Voss, which is also zebraless like this um um when i walked a lot um in finland and there was like some stones and stuff like this and this also while well, they're a bit uh crashed <laughs> underneath but um they were really good they were really good grip so this is this is good um it's really light so it's not like the clarissa or um geraldo or something like that it's a bit more yeah it's a bit lighter um but heavier than a Voss again i think um this is leather so this is not vegan this is leather it's like hydro leather so you can also uh, protect it with some spray you can also uh, put some grease on it not too much because it can be a bit you know um not sticky but do a bit of stain i think if you put a bit too much grease on it um that's it what can i say the price yes which is important even though it was my uniform pair there are 139 euro so uh, i don't know i think it could be around a hundred pounds something like that perhaps so yes so for now that's all i will try them and i will come back to you thank you again for watching and i'll see you in my next video cheers Okay, so I totally forgot to film the end of this video. Anyway, I'm gonna do it right now. I cannot show you the shoes right now at the moment. I will film it. Hopefully I will remember to film it um, since I got them home because they are now in my locker, which is really useful as I wanted to do this video anyway. So I just wanted to tell you quickly that the shoes were really good like I don't have much to say like I think the sole is better than the old Voss the old sandals that they made a bit like zebraless uh, sole but now it's it's a, a new zebraless sole so it's more comfortable I mean it's it's a bit stiffer so it, it it won't feel like super soft when you put your foot on it the only thing is that because it's not that soft my toes are not like pointing up I don't know why it did that with my old sandals and now it didn't and I really feel really in the end of the day I really felt stable but at first like the first minutes I really felt like I was not really standing up normally um, so I was kind of a bit afraid that I was gonna fall into the stairs of the shop but I didn't um, and yeah only the top of the the sandal I will show you when I get them home um, was a bit hurting at the end of the day but I think this is just I don't know I think it's because you know I was standing up a lot and I don't know it was the first day so this was not like something hurting which could be really really important I mean this is gonna go away and the yeah I wore it again another day and it didn't do this so it was perfectly fine um, it's 
kind of a bit heavy in a way it really it's really it's a weird feeling I don't know if you have already um, worn some you know platform in wood or something like that I think it's kind of the same you know um, stability the stability is really weird this is the first thing I, I need to say but the sole is really comfortable and I broke my toe well my laptop fell on my toe it was like super hurting lately and when I wore those sandals it was better than in the 1461 so yeah they're not bad they're not bad at all I'm gonna show you so this part is okay it's just this part when you know you walking and goes like this this can hurt a bit but it goes away no problem at all with this 